the, the whole really heavy. Uh, thing of Ken, I'm not a fan of, but it almost felt like they was demonizing men. You know what I'm saying? They're making them look like a uh, 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 one-dimensional groups. You know what I'm saying? So wait a minute. This is based off of the toys. Do they are they are they yeah. do they know that they're toys, toys or they're, are they? They're Barbie World. It's right, Barbie they're, World. They're toys. They don't know that they're being played with at the or you know they're they're like they're attached to the real world in some sense, you know, and um, but it's not real. You know, they're not real. They're dolls. Oh, okay. I thought this was like supposed to be. Who Barbie was based off of? I didn't know. No, that no, 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 no. It's a parody movie based off of like, I mean, kind of based off of. Uh, it had the message, but it's based off of like the dolls itself. Like, at one point, Ken takes over because he goes to the real world and finds out about uh, uh, misogyny. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bet. He took it back to Barbie <laughs> world, and Ken took Ken and the rest of the Kens took over Barbie. Like nobody else has their own name. It's just Ken and Barbie, <laughs> President Barbie, you know, the they you know, everybody is named. I thought Barbie. those characters had names. Malibu Barbie. Yeah, I yeah. guess that's their name. Not, yeah, no. Everybody is in general, they're just they're Barbie dolls. So everybody is Barbie. Oh, yeah. Just like the Ken dolls are all Ken. So no what matter. about the Asian ones? The Asian, they had the Latin, you know, they had one. Everybody for each name is Ken or either Barbie, except for Ken's friend or like Stacy. Which was like Barbie's little sister, or the one that was pregnant, and then there's weird Barbie. You know, when little girls play with their dolls a little too hard, start cut off their hair and start drawing on their faces. Everybody mm -hmm. seen weird Barbie. <laughs> so, all of that's drawn into it, and it's hilarious. Like weird Barbie is the only one that has like any real sense of like what you know real life is because you know so when him. he went back was he on some social justice stuff or what, what no was he was on they all he cared about was horses his his mink coat and um playing sports and it kind of like changed the whole dynamic to where all the barbies were just servicing all of the kids they're just like he, i can't wait to like tiki torch get can, a beer. Huh? <laughs> right, he's gonna give Ken a beer. I can't wait to have Ken serenade me and just sing all his songs to me. Then I had to go and like fix that dynamic because Barbie was supposed to be, you know, empowering for women. And when Ken went back, he literally just like ruined all of that. Was sure. this a message against the uh, the Caucasian average male or something? Because that's no, it's not. It's it's against okay. against patriarchy. Yeah, it's just against the patriarchy. Just say, in, so in, in, like it's more about women empowerment or like the acceptance of like being what it takes to like be a woman today. Because Barbie was upset because she was like stereotypical Barbie and nothing was wrong with her. Everything was perfect. She was blonde hair, blue eyed. Everything was perfect. She did the same thing every day. Mm -hmm. And then her mind started to shift because she started thinking about death. Barbie don't think about death because Barbie don't die. Barbie lives forever. Fresh, fresh, you made a face. What was that face about? Well, it was one, it was one scene when they went to the real world, right? And it was uh Barbie and Ken, they walking, and this random guy come out of nowhere and just slap Barbie on the ass. Oh, and yeah, she, it was real. And she punch him in the face. I'm like, yo, what what is this? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, why are y'all portraying niggas like this? Like, nobody's doing this in real life, like just just randomly in broad day, like just walking up on a woman they never seen and smacking on the ass. You know what I'm saying? Like that's it, your it, it, it almost like that's your experience. That's the <laughs> it, thing. That's your experience as a man. You don't believe that that's what's happening, but it, it is just, what's happening. It felt like it was like I'm it's no uh, like the, the whole really heavy. Uh, thing of Ken. I'm not a fan of, but it almost felt like they was demonizing men. You know what I'm saying? They're making them look like. Uh, 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 one dimensional brutes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I'm like, you gotta man, watch the whole movie. You gotta watch the whole movie, though. You see bits and pieces, you want to judge the whole movie based off of that. Um, um, like, when you, you watch bits and pieces of it to entice you to actually want to enjoy the product, and when you watch certain pieces, you're like, yo, I'm not gonna watch <laughs> this shit, or you know, I'm gonna go see this first day. You know what I mean? And like it was the latter. I mean the former for me. Like, like, come on, like when you like 
And then I saw, you know what I'm saying, the write-ups on it um, where it shows that he was one-dimensional and um, it was all about Bobby's world. I'm like, yo, it's like, there's no equality in this shit. It's got to be either or. Like, she didn't come to the real world to find out, like, yo, we all we all are equal and we should all service this shit. No, she went back to Bobby world to take that shit back over so Ken's could be one-dimensional brooks again you know what I'm saying? Servicing all the Barbies. Did you watch the whole movie? Yeah, that hey, he 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 on a serious think piece off 20 minutes. <laughs> right. You got to watch the whole movie. I said hey, that but the, the whole thing about it was not because I saw all of it. Ken did come off as not even come off as Ken was one dimensional because in Barbie world, with with Barbies and them selling their product, Ken is one dimensional. Ken don't do nothing. Ken ain't got no dream house. Ken don't have no car. Ken Damn. don't do nothing, right? Ken is Ken is just a doll. But the whole thing about Barbie is it's not about men. It's about empowering girls to think they can be whatever they want to be. And the, right. in the world, Ken a broke girls, ass nigga and a woman doing everything for him. Wait, no, what is that's your what perception is? of it? But what happened? Like, I'll tell you how it ended, right? Because I don't feel like y'all gonna watch the movie. But um, <laughs> well, spoiler alert. Um, how it ended was Barbie did realize because she Ken was all about Barbie, he was in love with Barbie, and Barbie wasn't in love with Ken. She just saw Ken just like she saw everybody else, her as her friend, right? Mm. And so he didn't he didn't like that. But then she had to tell him, like, you need to go. And she said she apologized for the way that she had been treating him like a second class citizen. She always had girls night. She never made time for him or anything like that. And so she apologized for treating him like that, which led him to look for, you know, what made him feel better or made him feel important. And said that you, for some reason, you know, this world is, it made it Barbie and Ken when it should just be, you know, when it should be Barbie, you know, and her friend and Ken himself. Who is Ken? Be, you know, be whoever Ken is. Find out who Ken is first before, yeah. you know, you come back to, to, to you know, who Barbie is. Because Barbie yeah. is a bunch of things. He's a then. non-select beta. <laughs> He's a sucker-ass <laughs> nigga. That's what Ken is. <laughs> it's not to portray the Barbie world isn't to portray what the real, real world is, though. Because what? the real world was the real world. And in a real world, you know, men are in charge of everything. So what? What actually is Ken's purpose then? I mean, just to be like the homie, the male homie. So we know that Barbie and Ken is the their dolls, and Barbie's purpose is to empower girls to believe that they can be whatever they want to be. Which and, I get that. <clears throat> right, and Ken is a male doll. So when you play with Barbie. <laughs> You can pretend Ken is whoever he is too. I've never seen little girls play with dolls. Uh, yeah, yeah, of yeah. course. But yeah. I, I thought I thought Ken always had a predestined. I thought he was her love interest. It, yeah. yeah, something her right. boyfriend. Ken thought he was his her love interest as well. You see your suckers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he, he might he might have some non-select energy right there. So yeah, I mean, where was where was Black I mean, Ken at then? Black, it was a lot of Black Kens. It was well, it was a, it was two main character Black Kens. Let me guess, that's who Barbie wanted. Not nah. at all. Barbie didn't want anybody. <laughs> Barbie's, uh, I get what is she? I guess asexual. I guess. I mean, I, I guess you don't want to put that in the air if it's they, a thing. they didn't put anything into the air. She just wasn't romantically involved with Ken. That the one Ken that she had. It's Barbie nice. ended up going to the real world and being a real person because she ended up having all those real emotions and stuff that she had and she felt like a woman now. She wasn't supposed to, she didn't feel like a doll anymore because she had mm. concerns and That's stress. Nice. That sounds a little dangerous, honestly. It's like she don't have. Oh, that's no... not a kid movie, though. You know that, right? Yeah. I watched yeah. it and I was like, "This is. It's not a. It's not a movie for kids." That's why I was like, "This is like a Barbie parody movie." It's not. It's not for. It's not for children at all. I'm glad I didn't take my daughter. Yeah, it wasn't that like advertised for kids. No. I thought it was. As Barbie. A lot of things nowadays, like the like Barbie. You see how old Barbie is, and like you know things of that sort. That that's all uh, steered towards the. Adults who used to play with them 
back when they were kids. Oh, you know? stop, so nobody had they nobody had their kids in there. Some people did have their kids in there, but my daughter never played with Barbies. She's always mm. played with LOL dolls, which is way worse than Barbie. You don't know if kids play with Barbie before. <clears throat> no, I mean I never had a Barbie myself. I couldn't. My parents wouldn't allow me to have a Barbie. Right. I've heard of that before too. And I, you know, we all know what that is. Because like in the movie, Barbie was Barbie. Everybody was Barbie. And Barbie just had black skin. And so my dad was like, that's just Barbie with brown skin. You can't have a Barbie. Whip. Whip.